My name is Max. Over the past 30 years, I have primarily voted Republican as an expression of how I believe my country, my government should function and what I believe should be its very limited role in my life. Now, part of this includes that my federal government must be able to unify us against enemies, foreign, domestic, and then organize the plan and lead the battle. But enemies can be microscopic. That our current federal government, led by Donald J. Trump, has not unified our country against this enemy and has been an absolute abject failure in the leadership responsibility of organizing our national response. He has dismantled the executive branch and its ability to respond to its only job, protecting and defending Americans. He purged the experts. He left the foxholes empty and the enemy just overran us. Donald J. Trump drowned our executive branch. He killed its competency. For 100,000 dead Americans, 33 million unemployed, Donald Trump lost this war. South Korea is right damn next to China. It's a free democratic society with fewer than 500 fatalities in the same time frame. Why am I firing Donald Trump? I refuse to give Donald Trump command of this nation's next challenge, or God forbid, the next war. Trump's government dismantled and removed the best of the Department of Energy in the first year of his administration, demanded ideological loyalty of our nuclear and climate scientists. You think a virus is bad? Try a dirty bomb in an American city because our government is too busy fighting itself to pay attention to important threats. No, for me, Donald Trump is not my next president. God willing, it will be Joe Biden. Clearly a decent man, a man of empathy, intellect, character. As far as the GOP, when they return to fiscal responsibility and common sense, I will support that conservative ideology. I go back the day the GOP rejects conspiracists, rejects the propagandists in its own party and the media, the liars, the sycophants. When Republicans stop looking the other way as domestic terrorists brandish weapons in state capitals and stops this anti-intellectual nonsense, I reject Trump, his autocracy, his incompetence. I reject his nepotism. For now, for me, the answer is the Democrats. It's Joe Biden. It's that simple. Thank you for sharing your time with me.